And more recently, uh, I'm one of the very few physicians who've been approved uh, for medical cannabis. Uh, uh, medical, I don't like to use marijuana, I mean medical cannabis uh, uh, for some uh, specific conditions, you know, cancer, uh, seizure disorders, glaucoma, Crohn disease, uh, 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 a few there, but like six or seven conditions that we can use them for. And, and now the law has passed, so I'm seeing more patients now uh, and recommend that they use uh, that they use the products. I'm a nurse. I know about medications. I know about prescriptions. I know about um, pharmacology. I know all of that, and I know that it's like a band-aid. It puts a band-aid on an open wound, but it doesn't make you better. It doesn't help you feel better. And lupus is not something that they're going to cure. So I want to live my life as comfortable as possible. I'm not able to work. Um, they told me, you're to the point you can't work anymore. My career was gone. I miss my job. Anybody in your family any history of lupus in the family, but the family that's that you know? I believe my grandmother. They didn't diagnose her um, properly, but she had the very same symptoms, and she died of complications to her lungs, and I, I trace it back to her. Okay. There is um, um, something that is natural, naturally produced, that will help me. I take a lot of medications and they're not helpful and they cause a lot of side effects and I believe very strongly with all my heart I believe that there's something natural that is available to people that the government says they can't have and I don't think that's right. I, I think it's, um, uh, it's devastating that they would keep that from you whenever it should be available to you. You're talking about medical marijuana? Medical, medical marijuana, yes, yes. And the effects of it um, will help so much more than um, the, the prescription medication that causes you to have so many side effects. I have um, my bones deteriorating because they give me so many um, steroids to treat the disease and the list just goes on and on and on and yet every day you're still in pain you're still hurting you're still having all of the effects and you're taking handfuls of medication all day long and you're still suffering and this uh, the medical cannabis is available to people to help them and they're not allowing them to have it it's long overdue i i have been waiting a long time for them to make this available to people now now, now that florida finally you know passed it so yes it become yes. Available. and obviously you came to me because i'm one of the yes. physicians uh, uh, that actually can, can that's recommend correct it. that's and, correct and how long do you take you to to find me because I know that... Uh... Well, I voted, of course, for it. And so as soon as I um, heard that it was passed, I was elated, of course, and I went online immediately to um, try to find a physician that I thought could help me. I feel very strongly in my heart that people should not have to suffer. They shouldn't have to be in pain every day when there's something available that will help them. Thank you so very, very much uh, for sharing your concern with you and I will try my best you know, to help you to assist you. And I appreciate you doing this because there's so many doctors that are very conservative that don't believe in it and that's, that's wrong I think and I hope that now that it's passed and as more people begin to um, have it available to them that they will begin to see that it is the answer and that it does help people and it'll change their views it'll open their minds and help them to see that they're um th it's a good thing for people thank you very very much you're welcome thanks mm -hmm.